Hallo Internet. Hier ist wieder Beckenzack für euch und willkommen zum nächsten Teil von meinem Let's Play zu Hartubo Boyfriendo Holiday Star. Ja, im letzten Teil ähm, waren wir ähm, in dem Kaufhaus unterwegs und haben vorher festgestellt, dass es böse, böse ähm, Weihnachtsbaumdiebe gibt. Und äh, die ganze Stadt ist in hellem Aufruhr. Und wir müssen jetzt zusammen mit Ryota herausfinden, wer die Weihnachtsbäume stiehlt. Und ich habe auch am Ende vom letzten, äh, beziehungsweise vom ersten Part, eine Vermutung aufgestellt, wer eventuell der ähm, Dieb sein könnte. Und ich bin gespannt, ob ich damit recht habe. Aber jetzt sind wir erstmal zurück im Café. Und ich bin gespannt, wie dieses vogelfreie Abenteuer weitergeht. <lacht> Uh, thank you for your efforts. We searched around where we had the tree, but we couldn't find any clues. I'm sorry, Mr. Urushihara. You didn't see them either, Mr. Urushihara? Correct. By the time Mr. Kavara and I got outside, the tree was already gone. That said... Was there something else? Please, look at this. Mr. Rebu sent it to me a few minutes ago. Mr. Urushihara profers his cell phone. A smartphone? <laughs> Fancy! <laughs> oh! Oh! Das sieht mir doch ganz verdächtig nach den äh, dicken weißen äh, Kugelvögeln aus. Mit Beinen <laughs> und Armen, die wir im letzten Teil gesehen haben. Könnte ähm, ich recht haben. Mr. Mal sehen. You mean these shadows are... Mr. Rabu said he took it just before he was rendered unconscious. Suspicious shadows carrying away the tree. They must be the culprits. Those silhouettes look awfully familiar. But maybe it's just my imagination. Probably nothing. I wouldn't have gotten this far in the vicious food chain if I worried about little things like that. Not natürlich nicht. There are two of them, then. They're awfully small. Though it's a little hard to see in this picture. Mr. Rabu has... Oh, sure you will. Mr. Rabu has always been one for strange local phones, so it would seem that the resolution is not particularly high. That does seem like him. This will help us a lot, Mr. Urushihara. Thank Mr. Rabu for us, too. How is he doing right now? Azami is taking care of him. Rabu always seems a little bit in a, incapable, or like he's in a subtly bad position. Sort of like he's always stuck being a background character. <laughs> It's not much, but we found a clue. We'll pick up the trail tomorrow morning. Later that evening at St. Pigeonations. Ah, Julia, war das nicht... War das nicht der... Der, der, der... Bruder von der äh, Schwuchtel-Franzosen? Ich glaube, ne? Ich glaube, den hatte ich extrem männlich gesprochen. Salutations, Mr. One. It is rather chilly tonight, isn't it? Äh, wie, ähm... Ähm, ja, hm... Wie nenne ich mir jetzt den One? Hm. You still here, Sakazaki Yuya? Haven't you been instructed to leave with the other students expecting emergencies? There's a little something going on, actually. Aside from the usual? And what would that be? There have been orders to investigate the Christmas thieves. High priority. That's the string of theft involving Christmas trees, isn't it? It's not as if they're growing legs and walking away after one. And it's a little hard to imagine them spontaneously disappearing. And what is a night of sexy and luxurious discussion of sweet holiday love without a sparkling tree? <laughs> I'm quite happy to take up the job to defend everything the ladies and gentlemen of the town have worked so hard to prepare for the special season. 
Well, you certainly see me gain math. It's good to have a little to have a little zeal, but don't go letting your guard down just because the case's question is completely idiotic. We never know who may have laid traps for us where. Roger that. I'll cuff it into my pigeon heart, Mr. One. I'll go take a look at a few things then. There's a tree here on campus after all. First I've heard of it. Where's it set up? In the student council room. You can see it from the grounds. Sakuya must want to show up with his big fine all natural tree. He doesn't let anybody touch it, but you can always see it in this window. It's really quite childish. Nothing wrong with a little vanity while he's still young. To a point, at least. Anyway, I'll go take a look at the council room and then head into town. I'll send my Ripper to HQ later. Adieu! <laughs> my Christmas saves. Stealing the town's festivity is hardly an admirable pursuit. I suppose I'll see if I can rustle up any gadgets to give Sakazaki a hand. Warum heißt der Mr. One? Was, in was für einer komischen äh, Organisation ist der denn? Wenn er sagt Mr. One, dann denke ich sofort an die Barockfirma von One Piece. <lacht> okay, jetzt sind wir also mit unserem sexy ähm, Yuya alleine in der Nacht in der Schule. Und ich bin gespannt, was jetzt hier passieren wird. Hm. The council room certainly has gotten some fancy renovations since Sakuya arrived. But this is him I'm dealing with. It'll look sneaking in it. <laughs> Nochmal, was? It'll look like sneaking in is going to be hard. But knowing him, he'll have overlooked something obvious. <gasps> what? What was that? <laughs> flutter, flutter, flutter. Bah. This could be bad. I smell explosives. W what? Oh my god, was ist passiert? <laughs> Wir wissen, was passiert ist. It's cold. Really cold. The morning air this time of year is dangerous indeed. It makes my nose hurt. The birds are all in full winter plumage. I want... Plumage. Plumage. <laughs> I wonder if it's like wearing a down comp... Down comfort everywhere. I wish I had winter plumage. Sadly, my skin is bare and tender as my heart. So <laughs> Sadly, my skin is bare and tender as my heart, so I might as well hurry up and get to school. Bare and tender, yeah. Love me, love me tender, love me sweet. Huh? There's an awful lot of activity on the grounds today. A crowd of birds is milling around the side of the building. Ah, Kazuaki war der Lehrer, ne? Ich habe keine Ahnung, ob ich den gesprochen habe. Mir gehen auch gerade die Ideen für Stimmen aus. <lacht> Stay calm, everyone. It may be dangerous, so don't get too close. Let's make sure nobody gets hurt, all right? Mr. Nanaki, what's happened? It must be bad if you're up and about and wide awake at this time of day. Oh, good morning. <lacht> oh, damit habe ich nicht gerechnet, dass er jetzt wirklich Mußschrott steht. Ah, Entschuldigung, Mußschrot. Oh, good morning, Mooschrot. Well, hmm. It looks like the sieves broke in, I suppose. The sieves? Could he mean? That's right, the Christmas thieves. Apparently they broke in last night. It seems that... It seems... It seems they took the tree from the student council room. Nice work, Sakuya! Nice flag retrieval! <laughs> War doch klar! Das, das passiert. But Sakuya looked so self-satisfied when he was talking about his perfect security. What happened? Mm. Well, look up. Up? As in, up at the council room? <gasps> oh, no! The council room's window, or rather, its wall, is blasted open. Wow, they're not just thieves now. I bet they had to break at least five more laws to pull that off. <laughs> they certainly do seem to want Christmas trees. They would have been better off just asking him, though. Huh? The tree was placed near that window, right? If they broke in like this... Ah! I let my gaze drop as I was lost in thought and I see something white on the ground. <laughs> 
It's extremely hard to tell with it, with it mixed in with the broken glass and bits of plaster, but it looks like some sort of fur. It's not a feather. Ooh! It looks like something that came off a stuffed animal, or maybe some sort of mammal. But I'm the only mammal in the school. This could be a valuable clue. Standing here won't help me find anything out, though. I need to get Sakura to tell me exactly what happened. I might as well check a few other things along the way. Where to first? Okay, also wir haben äh, in dem Trümmer äh, eine Art Fell oder Haare gefunden. Was merkwürdig ist, da ja eigentlich ähm, ich als Mensch äh, das einzige Säugetier sein sollte. <lacht> das auch keine Federn hat, deswegen könnte das ein wichtiger Hinweis sein. Wo gehe ich jetzt hin? The Council Room oder The Library? Uh, wir gehen natürlich in den Council Room, denn der ist explodiert. The Council Room is wrapped in unusual serious atmosphere. As if a robbery round enough, there was even a bombing. Out of those two, the later is almost certainly the more worrying. Bacon Zack! Oh, Ryota, good morning. As you can see, Zakuya has magnificently recovered the flag he raised the other day. As expected of an aristocrat. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was definitely a first-class flag retrieval. He certainly got me looking at the thefts more seriously. Now then, on to the crime scene! <laughs> okay, natürlich ist auf dem Laptop auch hinten da wo... Um <laughs> Da, wo zum Beispiel ein Apple-Logo wäre. Natürlich, das hat er für Boyfriend-Logo. Ja. Das sind diese Details, wofür das Spiel einfach unfassbar gut ist. <lacht> wow. Sakuya's flower security has been completely destroyed. What is this, Lenacy? Do you mean to tell me that bombing school building just come and practice in this barbaric land? Um, no, I don't think it is. I've never seen anything like this before. This is beyond the pale! Who conceived this wretched plot? Who? Wasn't... wasn't your security perfect, Sakuya? I thought you said it was on a completely new level compared to your... to our primitive concepts. Uh-huh! It was perfect! About the door, at least! What kind of rascal blows away through the wall? If they're going to break in, why not act with some semblance of decency and come it through the door? Blowing up the window isn't exactly a common way of forcing an entry, but isn't it a little bit of a problem if there's only security on the front door? Did you see the criminals at all, Sakuya? No. I, too, only learned of this upon arriving this morning. But... Look! Look at that! He gestures at the corner by the window. There's a pile of blackened stuff on the floor. What is that? Ugh! Is that oil? Or tinte? Or geschmolzen Lakritze? We will es erfahren. Wait, is that. the Christmas tree? <gasps> oh my god! Or oh, what's left of it? Looks like it got blown up along with the window. I was wondering if something had happened to the tree. It was right next to the window and wall that got blown up after all. Nothing left but ashes. They've left a criminal ultimatum next to it! An ultimatum? They haven't done that before, have they? Let's take a look. <laughs> what the f Fuck, Alter! We oopsed. We are very sad. The two went boom. Sorry. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I feel like they're young or they're geistig behindert. Um. We oopsed. We are very sad. The tree went boom. So we. It's a little lonely, but we're taking Mr. Sparkly Star. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. That's the ultimatum? It reads more like a kid's note apologizing for breaking Auntie Mildred's antique face. Natürlich. Tante Mildred. <laughs> Those scoundrels! 
to take the tree topper, the most valuable part, and run! Tree topper? The star that sits at the very top of the tree. Oh, so that's what it's called. <coughs> sure you go. They destroyed the tree and stole the topper. This is a dreadful affront to my illustrious name. I swear I shall seek them, find them, and impose upon them strict judgments. That would be vigilantism, Sakuya. Japan is a constitutional nation. You can't do that. But it's not as if. But it's not as if I don't see where he's coming from. If I spend that much time and effort decorating something just to have someone blown up the room it's standing in, I'd be pretty angry too. Mr. Urushihara's tree stolen, the curious tree reduced to cinders, and the top has stolen. We have to make sure that these tragedies don't repeat. But we can't really find the culprit just from this apology, or Christmas card, or ultimatum, or whatever that is. Let's ask Miss, Mr. One if he saw anything. He's on night shift, so he should have been here. Oh, good plan. Okay, that he Mr. One wahrscheinlich uh, kennen sollen. Lead us there, Moose Schrott! Stop treating me like your underling, your satin pants prairie chicken. <laughs> du Satang unter Wäsche tragendes Präriehuhn. Ja. Das ist, denke ich, eine gute Umschreibung. <coughs> you two go ahead. I'll stay here and see if I can find any more clues. See you in a little while, Ryota. It's awfully cold in here. I guess with that a hole that large in the wall, I might as well be outside. Oh, unser dicke, kleine Rumkugel. Dr. Iwamine, I hadn't expected to see you here. I came to see the corpse. What corpse? Natürlich geht doch wieder die Nussknackermusik los. Ach. Oh man. Where'd you hear. Entschuldigung, ich bin ja noch gar nicht der dicke Jeep vorgegangen. Where'd you hear that was a corpse? Oh, no corpse. And here I had my hopes up. Please don't say that with such a genu genuinely dejected look on your face. Well, no matter. It is still is quite a fascinating crime scene. I suppose I shall look around. Please, oh, sure you please don't mind me. I have no intention of interfering with you. I see no reason to tamper with the evidence. Just yet. Oh, was hat er vor? <laughs> Bantapuru. <laughs> Alone with the doctor in a half collapsed room. I hope I make it out of here alive. <laughs> Excuse us. What is this depressing room? It's the maintenance office. Mr. One's night quarters are here too. Ah, also Mr. One is der Hausmeister der Schule. I think it's comfy. It feels very lived in. Comfy? Hm. Let us do whatever we are here for and leave before the poverty and reprehensibility rub off. <laughs> Mr. One, are you in here? Ah, Juju. Salutations, mon ami. Did you come to visit me? Juja? He's sitting at a low tea table. <laughs> oh no, the irresponsible and slightly worn out Juja might be just a little bit too attractive. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Oh, I can't it too high sign. I knew it! A place as disgusting as this is bound to draw disgusting company! And a very fine morning to you too, Sakuya. We came to talk to Mr. One. What brought you here, Juja? I'm holding down the fort while One is out. Out? Immediately after a break in? Suspicious indeed. I suggest we apprehend him at the first opportunity. You misunderstand. He's taking care of a few things. So our investigation of the theft can go more smoothly. After all, 
he and I both saw. Juja and Wan? You saw the crime in progress? W what We did indeed. It's not either being a hero of justice. Trouble always seems to come to you. Why did you not notify me immediately? Filthy mongrel! Notify you who? Uh, notify you how? I've been asking for your phone number for months, and you always blow me off. Gah! Did you see the culprits, Juja? Yes. Fearsome foes, indeed. Stick your brakes too far into this and you could lose them. Don't say I haven't warned you. Hmm! How I like- how like you, Mongrel, to cover in this filthy hovel out of fear, I, for my part, shall find these wrongdoers and have my revenge! I, too, swear to retrieve the stolen trees on my honor as a hunter-gatherer. How brave of you. Let me award your courage with a little evidence. Okay, let's switch on scheme. Juja picks up one of a number of photographs lined up on the table and holds it out to us. They were already on their way out when I arrived at the scene, and alas, I was unable to keep their trail. But I am a professional. <laughs> but I am a professional, and I couldn't just let them get away. I made sure to capture them on film. These are the culprits. Ha! Tatsächlich, unsere dicken Marshmallow Kinder. What? What? What are these white things? Oh! See, they shook even a bold lady of hunter-gatherer origin. <laughs> That's not it, Juja. I know these creatures. Oh, are they friends of yours? Who are they, and where do they live? Tell me this instant. I don't know who they are exactly. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas! You too. Where are your parents? Merry Christmas! In any case, I'll have to take you to the employee's lodge. High society does have rules. Merry Christmas! Yeah, that's fancy. Let a flashback. <laughs> Those are the two things who got scolded by the security guard in the High Society Seagull Department store. <laughs> I must be sure sagen. Aren't they? They were caught breaking things in the Christmas section of a department store yesterday and got taken away by security. What in? It looks like they go after anything with Christmas on it. <laughs> Though I can sympathize with their enthusiasm for the Holy Night. <laughs> We thought they were only going after easy targets, but it looks like once they get a sight of something, they won't rest until it's theirs or destroyed. The entire city is filled with Christmas decorations. We have no way of knowing where they will strike next, and thus, no way of ambushing them. Not necessarily. We could lure them easily with an extra dragon tree and obvious plagues, don't you think? They've got guts, but they don't seem particularly intelligent. I agree with you, Yuja. I think we should try to bait them. Then it's settled. And the best bait would be the finest tree in the city. Right, Sakuya? <laughs> the finest tree in town. Do you know of a good one, Sakuya? Are you suggesting we use the LaBelle family's Christmas tree as a lure, mongrel? Of course! Given how much work you put into the council room tree, he almost certainly has a Gorgeous and decadent tree at home! It seems like the best choice. And you aren't about to just let them get away with having burned your tree over. Aren't you? Of course not! Where's your tree set up, Sakuya? In the main salon. It is not visible from outside. It would take a great deal of time and labor to move it outside and redecorate it. I do not think this is a realistic option. Well, have to rely on newspapers, ads, and word of mouth then. The LaBelle family moved here to Little Dove Hatcheman City from France, is displaying its gorgeous Christmas tree to the public. Or something. Who said anything about opening the mansion to the public? Why not take the opportunity to show off a little? It's your first Christmas here after all, 
and it should help spread the LaBelle family's reputation. <laughs> Come on, Sequoia. Open it up to the whole city. Let everybody know you have an extravagantly decorated tree at home. The thieves should hear the rumors and then come to see. And then we can catch them. <sighs> Very well. I shall assist you. Cool. I'll get everything ready for an announcement in the evening papers. Something like, the LaBelle family's Christmas tree is open for public viewing tonight. All Christmas enthusiasts welcome. We'll be fine, right? That sounds good. But what kind of super high school student are you to have that much club with the local newspaper companies? Any Maldove would become super for a lady as lovely as yourself, mon ami. Oh, 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 mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Er gräbt mich direkt wieder an. I shall be off then. Adieu. Loose Tonka! Juja's laying the bait for us, so... Should we work on a plan to catch the thieves at your house, Sakuya? A reasonable suggestion. We shall plan our strategy after school, then. It's still midday, but the winter's cold. At least today was a half day. It would be freezing in here if it were already evening. Why are we having the meeting in here, Sakuya? Is it not obvious? Because this is my domain. And natürlich. Your domain, though despoiled. Scum! Do you mock me? There is no despoiled in the dictionary of labels. Whatever, let's just make our plan already. Sakuya is unexpectedly good at getting off topic. <laughs> they used explosives here. How do you think they'll attack the mansion? They might pretend to be normal guests and sneak in the front entrance. They might, yes. But their goal is the tree, so even if they get inside... They will not be able to remove the tree. Jiro's photograph showed them to be quite small, so there is no way the two of them could carry it out. How could they get it outside then? I think they would need some sort of heavy machinery. So you think they'll show up in a truck or something? Any suspicious vehicle approaching the mansion will be neutralized immediately! So, we need to have guards watching in all directions for any sort of truck or crane. The mansion opens at 7. Should we, should we be there this evening too? Yes, that should help things got the most smoothly. I'll see you two there then. We need to catch these seas before Christmas itself arrives. Okay, ich bin gespannt. Der Plan ist ähm, ausgelegt. Und ich bin auch ehrlich gesagt gespannt, wie das Haus von dieser schwuchteligen Scheißtaube aussieht. <lacht> I still have some time before I need to go to Sakuya's house. Not quite enough to go home myself. What should I do? Maybe I should go pick up some sort of weapon in town? Didn't Angel say something about one of the old shops in town starting to stock Excalibur? <lacht> Natürlich! Man kann einfach so Excalibur kaufen! Maybe I should go there. Hmm? A similar figure emerges from the chemistry lab. Doctor? Ah, uh, if it isn't Miss Moosschrott. <laughs> You're done with classes for the day, yes? What business have you here? I was just heading home. What about you, sir? He appears to be trying to hide the large rack of test tubes he is carrying. I was doing some tests to confirm some things. To think that I would only get access to these samples now, it is simply unreasonable. He looks genuinely displeased. Has he ever been this openly emotional before? Maybe the tests went badly? Well, I'm not sure what's going on, but... Cheer up, sir! I'm sure something good will come of it. Something good? That is the last thing I want. Ooh! Ich sag, ein schön auf Krawall gebürstet, der Gute. <laughs> and with that blunt remark, he heads off towards the infirmary. I wish I could share some of my cheerfulness with him. I have so much I could brush my teeth with it. <laughs> Tell me, Mr. 
this moose schrott. Y yes, sir? He stops and turns around. Do you have any food allergies? Um... Allergies... Like to peanuts or fish? To soybeans, for instance. No, I don't. I don't think I do, at least. Is that so? He walks away, a self-satisfied expression on his face. You need to explain why you're asking, sir. If you just walk away looking pleased like that, you will get reported. <laughs> this is uh, a bit creepy. <laughs> ah, wunderschön. Ich bin gespannt, was als nächstes kommt. Ich hoffe, ihr auch. <lacht> ah, okay. Das ist jetzt anscheinend ähm, das lebel menschen The Korea's Christmas tree will open for display in just a few minutes. Staff birds walk busily about the mansion. In the center of the Grand Saloon... Ah! Der Weihnachtsbaum. That must be the tree. Such a vast presence even in a room this large. It certainly would be difficult to carry it away by hand. There appears to be quite a crowd gathered outside already. Apparently, there are plainclothes security officers scattered throughout the line. There are no... Of, uh, I'm sure you're wrong. There are, of course, a great number of security personnel within the mansion as well. Have no worry, have no fear. The classy, reliable girl guard is here. <laughs> oh, ich hoffe, er reimt weiterhin. Ah, the girl guard. Stern when necessary, and iron hand mask in a velvet glove. <laughs> I feel safer already. Your house really is huge, Sakuya. Isn't it tough to clean? I cannot comprehend your question. Why should I worry over such things when I have servants? You didn't even know how to use a mop until just recently, after all. <laughs> that sort of foolery is for commoners! It has nothing to do with a novel such as myself. Ah, oh, what a waste. You have the makings of a domestic genius, Sakuya. Yeah. You were way more you were way more help at the end of the year cleaner than any of us expected. <laughs> Sakuya appears troubled, no doubt unsure if he should take that as a praise or as an insult. In any case, I have deigned to reveal my magnificent Christmas tree before the eyes of beggars and plebs. Are you sure the thieves will come? I think that depends on them. Juja did a good job of getting the world out. I think we can safely say they know about it. I have deeply deployed elite bodyguards in the employ of the LaBelle family throughout the entire area. The thieves will be captured within two seconds of arrival. What the fuck? <lacht> der Butler. Und der ist ein Rabe. Okay. Hm. Wir gehen tatsächlich die Möglichkeiten aus, ähm, <lacht> Stimmen nachzumachen. Oder zu verstellen. Okay. Master Sakuya. What is it, Albert? Natürlich heißt er Albert. A letter has arrived, sir. Here it is, sir. <laughs> What does it say, Sakuya? They've got gods! It is a letter announcing their nefarious intent! It says they're coming? May I see? Jetzt bin ich mal gespannt. Sakuya hands a letter to Ryota. It says... We want the big tree. Merry Christmas. We want the big tree. Merry Christmas. This... I guess it's a letter of intent. An awfully cute note. <laughs> It might almost be a Christmas card or a letter to Santa. <laughs> They want the tree! Na, komm schon, meine Maus spinnt. Ah! Was ist los? Ah, okay. And expect us to hand it over. If they want it, they can come in and claim it. 
Merry Christmas. They say they won't give it to us. Ah, so, das sind jetzt die beiden. Merry Christmas. They say if we want it, we should come and take it. Hm? Da sind sie. Oh, was ist passiert? S Sakuya, behind you! <laughs> Merry Christmas! It's time for plan B. There! It's Sam Sakuya, the Christmas thieves! W what? After them! Seize them! Have you not holes for eyes, you confounded girl? How did they get in this far? Were they hoping to get in the tree just by asking nicely? <laughs> yeah, wahrscheinlich. It's no good, Sakuya. I tried my best to catch them too, but they got away. I've received no word from security teams either. It would appear they have escaped. What a dreadful waste of an opportunity. They said something about plan B before they left, right? I don't think they've given up yet. We'd better stay on guard. I am well aware. Let us return to the mansion. Okay, the Weihnachtsbaum is weg and it's nun kommen. Ah, it's cold. And the thieves haven't shown up either. It's almost midnight already. Maybe they've gone home for the day and are all snug and cozy under a kotatsu. <laughs> wow, I want to be under a kotatsu. <laughs> I have prepared some ginger tea for you, miss. Please. Oh, the butler. Thank you so much. I always thought that I always thought black butlers know just what you need. Mm mm mm. Natürlich, they are black butler. Uh 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 uh. Ah, schön bisschen Yaoi hier, ne? Indeed, miss. What word from outside? Nothing to report. Schedule check ins from all teams are no on time, master. Nothing to report. Hmm, I have those cowards given up already. It's way too late for us to be up and about. I wish they'd just tell us if they're not coming. What was that noise? Enemy armor in the northwest sector. We're under attack. Sakuya, Ryota, let's go. Oh, it's wird hier richtig intense, Leute. The nighttime streets are filled with sudden activity. That guard mentioned armor, right? Which means they've brought some sort of vehicle, like a truck or something. It matters not. My elite lapel security will have them neutralized in a matter of seconds. A report, Master Sakuya. The lapel security forces were neutralized in seconds. You see? This is what happens to those who stand against the lapel family. <laughs> Sakuya, wait! That's not what he said! I was gonna say, have I forgotten? He said we're, not have! Ah, uh, we're, sorry. What? Indeed, sir. This noise. Something's coming up. Uh, look at that! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm Panzer! Ein verfickter Panzer! <lacht> Alter! Die geht voll scharf! <lacht> It's the Christmas Thieves! In a tank? Wow! They weren't bringing just a truck! This is way more than I expected! Das ist mehr als wir alle erwartet haben, denke ich! Merry Christmas! We are stealing the tree! We are stealing the tree! Gah! What do we do? It's headed right toe! They brought life ammunition? Alter! They have scharfe munition! Stop! Stop! What sort of demons would damage my beautiful mansion? There are still birds inside! 
I'll go get them out of there. They blew up the council room without a second thought. At this rate, your house is going to end up looking looking like mine. <laughs> I cannot have that. We need to stop them. What can I do? <laughs> I need to stop the thief's tank. Oh, endlich darf ich mal wieder eine Entscheidung treffen. I need to stop the thief's tank. Yeah. What? Fist of the teenage girl. <laughs> Was? <laughs> Die Faust des Teenager-Mädchens. Oder eine Mailbox-Attacke. Ich habe keine Ahnung, was beides sein soll. Aber natürlich wähle ich, weil es lustiger klingt, die Faust des Schulmädchens. I clench my fist and assume the stance. The enemy is straight ahead. They cannot dodge. I can feel the strength of Gaia beneath me. My love. My life I placed in this hand. I make my declaration here. The Empress arrives! Take this! Immobile fist of the original teenage girl! Nothing. <laughs> it did nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sakuya. I've never tried to hunt an animal made of metal before, <laughs> so I don't know where its weak points are. Even my elite guards were no match for it. There's nothing a bird or human can do to that thing. A sharp crack echoes through the night. And the tank stops. Oh, what's passiert? What's passiert? Juju. <laughs> Er hat ein Snipergewehr. Er hat ein verficktes Sniper Rifle. <lacht> Und was geht, was geht mit der Musik auf einmal? No, no, no. A gentleman dove must never give up so easily, Sakuya. Wow. Juja. And you've kept the lady up this late. Never mind the thieves. You're the real villain here. Please forgive him, mommy. Oh, no. It's fine. I wasn't able to do anything anyway. You. You rascal! What is that thing? What kind of high school student has one of those? This? It's an anti-material rifle. Bad, <laughs> natürlich ist es das. A must-have item for young men in Japan. In <laughs> Japan these days. Do not mock me with jests! But Sakuya, even I have a broad axe. <laughs> of course, a fashionable young man like Juja is going to have an assault rifle or two. Aber <laughs> natürlich. <laughs> Selbst ich habe eine 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 um, Breitaxt. Und dann wird natürlich auch so ein um, modebewusster junger Mann wie Juja ein zwei Sniper Rifles haben. Natürlich. Precisely. I hope you have learned something about Japanese culture today, Sakuya. Japan. Surely is a complicated and confounding place. Juja, look out! It's still moving! It would seem so. Alas, I was hoping to have things cleared up and be walking the sweat lady home by now. The sweet lady. Ich hab, ich hab grad gesagt, the sweat lady, also die schwitzende Dame. Nein, das ist natürlich die süße Dame, die sweet lady. Sorry. <laughs> Don't lay a finger on Mooshrod, lecherous cur! She is my underling! Since when? A lady never likes a man who tries to monopolize her, Sakuya. Don't bend my words! I had no such thing in mind! <laughs> Are you sure? Anyway, it's time to end this. Adieu, mysterious thieving duel. Bam! It stopped! Hat die beiden jetzt geheadshotted? <laughs> nice job, Yuya. You're acting straight up cool for once. Well, thank you, Monomi. I am honored by your words. Merry Christmas. Connect this with this. Merry Christmas. Stick that there. Merry Christmas! We fixed it! We fixed it! Yay! <gasps> it's not dead yet! Oh, oh dear. 
I had thought I immobilized it. Have you no other plan, Kerr? I have not prepared any more ordnance, no. It seems I have let I have met my match. Forget preparations! Would a super student like you really give up this easily? I'm not done yet, Monami. That said, those two possess an unusual degree of. Back and back, look out! <coughs> back and back, are you hurt? <laughs> I'm fine. Juja, wait! Your tail! Your tail is burned! It smells delicious! <laughs> All that matters is that you're safe. A little burn like this is just another medal of bravery. Zakazaki, you fool! Don't go raising flags here! Come on! We'll withdraw! You seem to be having difficulties. <gasps> Der dicke Rumkugelvogel. Who'd have expected him to show up here? Dr. Ivamine? Why are you here? I took the liberty of examining the council room this morning. I find this case rather interesting. I could help you out if you like. Of course, if you don't need my assistance, I will leave. I do have other things to be doing, after all. I can't really see his face in the darkness, but he sounds even more uninterested than usual. Maybe he's in a bad mood again. But not even the doctor would bluff about something like this, right? I think you will find me more... I'll show you one. I think you will find me more reliable than the sign that self-confided dove at your side. What a sharp tongue you have, Doctor. Please, Doctor Ivamine, if if you have some way of stopping those thieves, please help us. I had stop I had hoped to take them alive, but at this point I won't object if you decide to obliterate them entirely. Sakuya, no! They're doing bad things, but I could never live with myself if I let you kill something that adorable. <laughs> I have no intention of killing them. Miss Mooshrot. Yes? The doctor tosses a ball, or rather, a sort of oblong metallic lump to me. Throw it at the tank. You should be able to lend it enough force to rupture the casing. Ah. It's a grenade. Leave it to me, sir. Yeah! Look! Look! I did it! Hole in one! Well done. You have a good throwing arm. But what did that do? There was no great explosion. A tear gas bomb. He's been too dunkel gewesen. A tear gas bomb, right? Huh? The tankers thrust him some sort of gas? What? Doctor, we must withdraw! We'll be affected too and won't be able to secure the thieves! Can you stand, Juja? We need to get... The gas is spreading throughout the entire area. We need to get back to the mansion and send out guards with gas masks. <laughs> the gas has no effect... on us anyway. Huh? <laughs> oh my god, wie sie aussehen. Uh. Achoo! <laughs> the tank hatch opens and the two white creatures stagger out. Ah, they look terrible. Finding an elegance pathetic to them was quite simple. I found plenty of samples to work with in the council room. After all, they are currently experiencing symptoms similar to those exhibited by people suffering from pollen allergies. 
cleverer Vogel. Muss man ihm lassen. The elegant in this case is soybean flour. Ah, deswegen hat er mich vorhin gefragt, ob ich gegen Sojabohnen allergisch bin. Aha. Mr. Sakazaki had already created a number of holes in the body of the tank, so it defusted quite beautifully. I am pleased to see it worked. How kind of you to give me some credit despite my miserable failure. I hadn't expected that from you. You're an, ex you're ex <laughs> you're an exemplary teacher. Thank you, Mr. Sasaki. You flatter me. Sir, how did you know so much about these frivolous, unidentified creatures? Looks like he's still in a bad mood. He's staring off into space. Were the tests he was doing this afternoon for this? If so, it was an undeniable success. Shouldn't he be happy? Anyway, they're ours now. Tie them up. Leute, wir haben die <lacht> die die ähm, Weihnachtsbaumdiebe gefangen. Endlich. Und ich denke, das ist wieder auch mit diesem wunderschönen Bild ein guter Zeitpunkt, um hier wieder einen Cut zu machen. Ich bin gespannt, äh, wie es jetzt weitergeht und was die Verbindung von unserer dicken Rumkugel mit den widerlichen, komisch aussehenden Marshmallow-Vögeln ähm, äh, ist. Vielleicht sind es ja seine Kinder oder sowas. Was widerlich wäre, wenn ich bedenke, dass sich dieser dicke Vogel fortgepflanzt hat. <lacht> Aber gut, ich bin gespannt. Ich hoffe, ihr äh, schaltet auch das nächste Mal ein. Ich bedanke mich fürs Zusehen und bis zum nächsten Mal sage ich... Hause, Bounce!